You don't have to look too far to find predictions of doom and gloom at the moment, but some analysts are making a very different prediction. They say that we're actually heading into the Roaring Twenties 2.0. Just like after the Spanish flu pandemic a century ago, people will be desperate to have a good time once the vaccines have been delivered and the stupidly complex layers of restrictions have been lifted. Despite being in a pandemic-induced recession, families under house arrest have moderated their online shopping habits enough to accumulate a year's worth of savings and debt reduction. Who's to say we won't all go on a lottery winner type splurge next year and buy new cars, new clothes, new cruisers, and that des res in the country with an acre of land around it? We're still going to have higher unemployment, but we had a jobless boom in the 1980s, so that won't hold everyone else back. We'll also see another record-breaking year of government spending, with £128 billion boosting their largesse by 14.5%. And in an absolute gift to Dishy Rishi, we shouldn't get too much inflation because the economy is running at 10% below capacity. So dust down your flapper girl outfit, Practice your Charlton dancing steps and get ready for the Roaring Twenties Redux.